Well, for the second time in a relatively short period, uh, we're here today to, to announce the uh, retirement of one of our legendary coaches around here, uh, Terry Skrypek, who has been the head hockey coach at the University of St. Thomas here for the last 23 years, has decided to retire from coaching and from the University of St. Thomas. Uh, and what a program he has built over that 23 years. Uh, Never had a losing season, 400 and some wins, uh, 13 conference titles, 11 or 9 uh, playoff championship titles, 11 times in the NCA. Uh, it's, a, it's a program that uh, everybody in the country looks up to, and, and we certainly will miss Terry. And uh, certainly saddened to, to lose him as a staff member, but uh, certainly wish him the best as uh, he moves on to another phase of his life. And, uh, what we'll always uh, remember, I think, is how well respected our program has been under Terry Skrypek. Uh, also, how tough his, his team's played, and uh, what a good coach all the way around Terry has been, and what a great staff member he has been. So, at this time, I'd like to turn the, the, the mic over to uh, Terry for some remarks. I guess the big question I've had is, is why? You know, why am I doing this? Uh, it's kind of like uh, you get an inner voice, some, something that just tells you it's time. You know, and I've been doing it for 40 years, and it, uh, it's not easy to w walk away from, but it's, it's something that says it's time to, to walk on. And I guess the way I've looked at it now is that it's not the end. Uh, you know, it's not the end of, somebody says the end of what? Well, it might be the end of my coaching career, but it's also something new. It's kind of like, is the glass half empty or half full? It can be something really good, too. Uh, I don't know what's in store for me. Uh, there'll be something down the road. Uh, I'll do whatever that is, and I'll have fun doing it. It, it could be a great beginning, too. So uh, I've had a great stay here. This has been a phenomenal place to work. Uh, I've been able to coach some of the, the finest athletes that any college coach could coach. Uh, I look at some of the athletes I've been able to coach here, and I've been blessed that way. And I think it's because of St. Thomas. It's because of the reputation of the school and the people that are here. This, this institution has got a reputation that is uh, second to none. And we've been able to attract great, great athletes. And uh, it's been fun. It's never been a, 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 a case where you know, I didn't want to come to work or it was work. Uh, it's always been, hey, That's you're going to play a kid's Vanilla. game. And it's fun. And it's always been fun. And uh, I've really enjoyed it. So, uh, again, uh, I've had uh, a great stay here. It's been a, a great run. And, and I think it's time for someone else to step in and, and, and take it over and, and keep it going, keep the tradition going that St. Thomas has and, and the, kind of the foundation that's been, you know, been set here right now. So, uh, with that, uh, I've thoroughly enjoyed my stay here. Uh, and again, it's it's maybe an end in one phase, but it's also a new beginning. So it's something I can, something else that I can do, and something I can jump into. Thanks. We'll make uh, time for questions in a little bit here, but uh, maybe first I'll turn the mic over to uh, Duke Besser, who has been uh, uh, Terry's sidekick all the way along here, and uh, let him make some remarks, and we'll turn it over to Parker Burgess, who's one of the seniors this year. Well, it's a bitter, bitter, bittersweet day, I guess, is the best way I can put it. Uh, it's one of my best friends. I've learned everything about the game from Scry. When I think of Scry, I think of integrity, honesty. Um, I think any, any player you talk to who was uh, very honest with him, sometimes they didn't want to hear what he had to say, but... It's helped him become a better person, for sure, and obviously a better player. And I think that anybody that has played for Scry will tell you the same thing. He never guaranteed one half of the position in the recruited. They had to earn it. You know, Scry's a St. Paul guy, a Cretan guy, middle class guy. Everything he did, he had to work for. And he instilled that in his players. And he really prepared them when they graduated to go out in the world. Every player will tell that. I'm going to miss my bud. He's been uh, a mentor. Uh, I just, uh, he's just, he's a pretty special guy. And I'm just, I feel very fortunate to just be a part of uh, a little bit of his life. 
and I appreciate that. Thanks. Thanks, Jim. You bet. Thank you. Well, I guess for myself as a player, I've been very fortunate to play for Scry. I know there's a lot of players here uh, on last year's team that uh, would definitely say the same thing. He, uh, you know, like Duke said, he's fair and he's honest with everybody, but he, he really loves the kids. And, uh, you know, even even if you're not in the lineup or, or you know, you're, you're struggling with hockey, he's always there to talk and uh, to be honest with you. And he does love the kids regardless of you know what we do on the ice he, he really cares about us about us as individuals you know he helps us out after uh, we graduate with getting jobs and and uh things like that you know i know for myself i transferred here last year coming here to st thomas with scry and the assistant coaches he's had has uh, brought a new passion for me for hockey and i loved coming to the rink to play for him and, and play for st thomas i look at myself i want to be be a coach and i'm done playing hockey and uh scry is a big reason why and I'm sure, you know, when I move on and hopefully become a coach, that, you know, a lot of things Scry's done, I'm definitely going to do myself. And I just, I feel very privileged and blessed that I was able to play for St. Thomas and uh, play under Scry. And uh, I know all the other boys definitely feel the same way. This past season was an incredible run, and I think every player on this team is, is grateful that they helped get you out on top because we knew that's what you wanted, and... Uh, you know, we were glad to be a part of it, and you were a big reason why we accomplished that. Thanks, Mike.